concerning turn of events, Russian President Vladimir Putin warned of a potential retaliation as Ukraine received a shipment of cluster munitions from the United States. The delivery of these controversial weapons comes as the conflict between Ukraine and Russia continues to simmer. Significantly, President Putin stated that Russia possesses a sufficient stockpile of cluster munitions and will take reciprocal action if Ukraine utilizes these weapons. It is worth noting that Russia has not used cluster bombs in the ongoing war in Ukraine so far. According to Putin's remarks, Ukraine has pledged to employ them only in areas away from densely populated regions seeking to avoid civilian casualties. The arrival of cluster munitions from US provides critical ammunition for Ukraine's offensive efforts and aims to push through the Russian front lines. President Joe Biden's decision to provide this support followed months of deliberation among the U.S. leaders. Both Moscow and Kyiv have been accused of using cluster munitions despite not being signatories to the Convention on Cluster Munitions. This international treaty prohibits the production, stockpiling, use and transfer of these weapons. Cluster bombs have long been criticized due to their high dud rate, leaving behind unexploded bomblets that pose a threat to civilians long after conflicts have ended. In a separate development, an emergency situation on the Russian-built Crimean bridge resulted in traffic being halted. Reports of explosions on the bridge have emerged and two people have reportedly died due to the collapse, causing further tensions between Ukraine and Russia. Crimea, which was annexed by Russia from Ukraine in 2014, remains a disputed territory recognized internationally as part of Ukraine. The situation in the region remains highly volatile as the exchange of military support and reported incidents continue to escalate tensions between Ukraine and Russia.